lot of people have asked me how 2116 came about more than 50 years ago. Way back in 1947, Charles Lawton came to me and asked me to write a full-length stage play of my novel, Fahrenheit 451. And I wrote that novel into a stage play and gave it to Charles Lawton. And he read the stage play and then said to me, Mr. Bradbury, this play does not work. I broke into tears because of all the people in the world I wanted to work for, it was Charles Lawton. I walked down the street crying. But then, several months later, Charles Lawton came to the house with his wife, Elsa Lanchester. And he said, Mr. Bradbury, Elsa and I would like you to write a one-act play for us. Do you have any ideas of a play that would fit the two of us? A play about the future of some sort. I said, yes, I think I have some ideas. I would like to come to your house and tell you the ideas and see what you think of them. So Charles Lawton said, all right, come to our house tomorrow afternoon and tell me your idea for a possible play that would be good for me and Elsa and we'll give you our opinion and we'll give you a glass of martini. So I went to the house the next day and I told them the idea for 2116 about these two people in the future with a happy anniversary. And Charles Lawton said, I think Elsa, Elsa and I agree that's a splendid idea. Will you write it for us? I said, yes. So during the next two or three weeks, I brought over three copies of each page of 2116. And at four o'clock, I sat with Charles Lawton and Elsa Lanchester, and we drank martinis <laughs> while wow. I was writing this script that you have now. And when we finished, Charles Ross said, this is splendid. Let's do this. They made preparations to do the play, but Charles Lawton got busy doing many films, and I had to go to Europe to do a film with Sir Carol Reed, and time passed, and suddenly Charles Lawton was gone, and the play never got put on. It's a terrible shame because I would love to have seen Charles Lawton and his wife do the play. Now the wonderful thing is, all these years later, these good people are putting on the play, and it fills me with glorious ecstasy and happiness. And I'm glad at long last the play is put on. I'm sure the ghost of Charles Lawton is seeing this play, and I'm sure that he greets it with shouts of ecstasy and glory and love. The play plays beautifully. It's my best play, and I'm glad that at long last it's being put on.